Hi folks, to the dusty trails and back alleys of Tremors Trivia, where we unearth the making of this so-called cinematic gem. Yes, we're talking about the film where Kevin Bacon and Fred Ward heroically face off against oversized earthworms in a desert wasteland. Nothing says Hollywood magic like battling giant subterranean pests, right? Prepare yourself for some head-scratching, eye-rolling and chuckle-worthy moments as we uncover the real stories behind the movie that brought us such memorable lines as, I mean, what the hell are graboids? Get ready for tales of existential crises, unexpected talents, and mechanical worms with diva attitudes. So, let's dig in, shall we? Tremors was initially titled Beneath Perfection, before the filmmakers settled on the more impactful and descriptive title that reflects the underground threat in the film. The concept of the giant underground creatures, known as graboids, was inspired by real-life sandworms, desert ecosystems, and burrowing animals. They mixed scientific fascination with a dose of B-movie magic to bring these creatures to life. Who says horror can't be educational? During one of the water stunts, Kevin Bacon misjudged a jump and ended up with a twisted ankle. The incident caused a minor production delay. Who knew diving into shallow water could be more dangerous than dodging graboids? Michael Gross, known for his role as the lovable father on Family Ties, transitioned almost immediately from wrapping up the sitcom to filming Tremors. He finished shooting the series finale on one day and was on the set of Tremors the next, diving straight into the drastically different role of the gun-toting Burt Gummer. Despite his successful career, Kevin Bacon had serious second thoughts about taking on Tremors. He later admitted that at one point, he felt the decision might have been a career killer. During filming, he had moments of doubt wondering why he was doing a movie about underground worms. Cult favorite Bruce Campbell was nearly cast as Valentine McKee. Imagine the king of camp horror tackling graboids. Sadly, scheduling conflicts kept him from the role, leaving us to wonder about the one-liners we missed out on. Country music superstar Reba McIntyre, who portrayed Heather Gummer, amazed everyone with her shooting skills. Who knew she could handle a shotgun like she was born in the Wild West? Turns out, Reba was more Annie Oakley than Nashville's sweetheart. The animatronic graboids were known for malfunctioning on set. The practical effects team had their hands full with these temperamental creations, leading to some hilarious and unintended moments. Sometimes the worms just wouldn't play nice. Fred Ward, who played Earl Bassett, had a surprising fear of the animatronic graboids. It's ironic that the tough guy actor was unnerved by mechanical monsters. Guess even Earl has his limits. Ron Underwood faced considerable pushback from Universal Studios, who envisioned Tremors as a straightforward horror film. Underwood insisted on a mix of horror and humor, fighting for every joke and scare. Guess who had the last laugh? Originally, Tremors was slapped with an R rating due to its graphic content and language. The filmmakers had to dial down the profanity and gore to snag a PG-13 rating. Turns out, kids love monster movies as long as the monsters don't swear. If you enjoyed our video, feel free to subscribe. 